You know, there comes a point in every man's life, you know, he wakes up one day and he realizes that his whole life, it, it consists of waking up, going to work, getting out of work, going home, doing the same thing over and over every day. And he comes to the conclusion that, like, this can't be life. Like, like there has to be more to this than what I'm doing every day. And he begins this search. He begins looking for his purpose on this planet. And that's what we want, we want to talk about today, man. Man's search for meaning. Boy Soul Immortal. Man's search for meaning. Now, the most important thing in, in man's search for meaning on this planet is, is first, you know, knowing who he is. It's important to know who you are. And, and the only way that I can think for a man to find out who he truly is, is is to isolate himself from everything. You know, I've gone, I've gone, man, a few months, maybe three, four, five months, I'm not sure, without making a video, man. I, I I've spent time to myself, you know, not really been hanging out, just just to um, just to elevate myself as a man. You know. I just think it's important, man, that that a man can get in a position, man, where he can, he can gather his thoughts and, and learn about himself without without outside influence. You know, for some men, this may be several months, this might be a week, this might be a few days, this might be a few hours. But I think I think it's important that periodically every man have have this self evaluation period. You know, to, to really know who he is. And, and during this this you know evaluation period, man, I think I think that we should question everything. You know what I mean? Like like why do we believe what we believe? Why do we why do we do the things that we do? You know, because the far majority of things that we do, the things that we believe, is because of what somebody else put in us, man. Whether it's our religion, whether it's our uh, uh, political affiliation, you know, whether it's our, our views on uh, relationships, whether it's our views on how to raise our children, whether it's our views on the way schools operate, everything that we know, man, is based primarily on someone else's opinion. So I think that dur during this this stage of isolation, man, a man should, should, should be able to uh, erase all this uh, from his mind, man, and pretty much just relearn everything, man. Because in my mind, that that's the only way that you can find purpose. You know, and 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 during this during this stage, man, I think that it's it's important for a man to to really know what he wants in life. Because you know, during man's search for it, for his meaning, his purpose on this planet. He has to have some sort of goal in life, some kind of, you know, where does he want to end up? What does he want to do? What does he want to achieve? Because if not, man, you, you just, you know, by default putting yourself in this rat race. You know, and I think that's I think that's why a lot of us as men uh end up in just stagnant situations. You know, we wake up one day, you know, we're 70, 80, 90 years old, and we look back on our lives, man. And, it's, and we're just like, what the hell did I do, you know? So really, man, it's all about making the most of this life, man. Enjoying, enjoying this life, man. Being, 
being fulfilled in this life, man. And it starts with knowing where you want to go. Fear, man's greatest hurdle. You know, I, I think there's some inside of us as men that, that's constantly pushing the limits, man. You know, all of us have that, that one friend, man, that that's always like, you know, hold my beer and, and he's doing something just off the wall crazy, man, some stunt, you know. I think that's just in us, man. You know, but but why is it in us? Why why are we like that, you know? You know, I I've I've fought in the war, man. I've I've driven motorcycles, man, and at, at excess speeds, man. I've jumped out of planes. And I and I asked myself, like, what is it in me that that that's constantly wanting this this urge, man, to, to push a limit, man. And, and I think it's all, in all of us, man. You know, and, and it's it's just the way of us, you know, expressing to the universe, man, that 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 deep down, man, we we don't fear anything as a man. You know what I mean? I mean, I mean, what is there to fear? You know, I mean, going broke. I mean, I've lost a job. You know, I've been laid off, man. I've you know. I, I've been in a situation, man, where I had, you know, less than a hundred dollars to my name. You know what I mean? I mean, broke. I'm still making it. I'm still here. I'm alive. What do we fear? Uh, lack of lack of food. You know, I've been in a situation, man, where I've had a snicker and tap uh, and tap water for dinner. You know what I'm saying? And I had to pawn stuff to get that. So, so what is there there really to fear? You know, I'm still here. I'm alive. I'm well. You know what, death? I mean, do do we really die? I mean, w once you understand how this world works, man, once you understand, you know, what life really is, how we're made, what we're made of, you, you understand man, that, that there's really no death, man. And once you come to, to the conclusion, once you understand that there's no death, there's there's really nothing more to fear after that, man. As a matter of fact, man, the only thing that I fear at times is the fact that I don't fear anything. Not a person, not 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 a thing, not not the loss of anything. You know, anything that I have, anything that I purchase, whether it's, you know, cars or toys or whatever, I can lose that at any moment, man. It it it, it means absolutely nothing to lose it. Absolutely nothing. So so fear, man, once once a man understands, you know, what fear is or that really, you know, the things that we fear really are nothing or really don't exist, you know, he, he, he becomes elevated, man. I think just by default, he goes to a different, a different level in life, man. Execute, execute, execute. Now, now this is where I dropped the ball, man, for, for several years of my life, man. You know, even since... Ever since I was, you know, in my 20s, early 20s, man, I've had great ideas, man, things I wanted to do, you know, places I wanted to see, uh, things I wanted to experience, man. I had these ideas, but, but that's all they were, man, were, were, were ideas. There was, no, there was no action behind it, man. You know, and, and I think that, that that's all of us. You know, all of us is men, man. I think... I think that we have greatness inside of us, man. You know, things we want to achieve, things that we can achieve, man. And we just don't execute it, man. So I think that the execution is something that uh, we all need to, 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 to up on. You know, even even starting this, this YouTube channel, man. I contemplated starting this YouTube channel for about a year and a half before I even, even started it, you know. And I always, uh, you know, wrote some notes down on what are the things I wanted to talk about or whatever, man. And, and, and one day I just said, you know what, I'll make a video. At ease. It's your boy, Soul Immortal. Man, I'm sitting here in the Aztec caves of El Paso. Got a nice view, man. Life is good. Man's search for meaning. And, and next thing you know, man, you realize that there are several men that have the same mindset, that are thinking the same things, that are, that, that are going through the same things, or 
to have experienced the same things, man. And, and, and I look back, I say, you know what, man, I should have started a channel a long time ago. So, so what is it all about, man? What is, what is man's search for meaning? What is our purpose for being here, man, as men? You know, and I've come to the conclusion, man, that it's about just living our lives to the fullest, about understanding that we can manifest anything we want, just understanding, man, that we, we are here to be rulers of this planet, man. And that we should all govern ourselves accordingly, man. You know, and, and that's kind of the direction, man, I want to want to take my channel, man. I've, uh, you know, you know, we've talked about different things, man, different, you know. And, and a lot of those, th those things are still still relevant and, and we will still talk about, you know, certain MGTOW issues, man. And, and, and uh you know, the relationship between men and women and all that stuff. But I'm more focused on now, man, just us as men moving forward. We, we've we identified a lot of the problems, uh, but it's about, it's just about us moving forward as men. It's about being the examples to the younger men that are uh, uh, giving them, a, a, a showing them how to, how to do this thing, man. That That's really what it's about, you know. So, um, I want I want to thank all the the people who who have subscribed, man, over the last few months, man. All the comments, man. I got a, I got a ton of emails, man, that I need to uh, address, and I'll be addressing those, man. Uh, but uh, be sure to like, share, subscribe, man, and uh, I really appreciate it. It's your boy Solar Mortal, and I'm out.